welcome back to our Rustic Therapy Zone. Today I am coming up with one more bottle art on your request. Can you guess what it is? Okay, so let me give you a clue. Do you remember this? Yes, it is a lip and bottle art with 3D liners. And guys, you know what? Is the trending video on my channel. Thank you for showering your love, guys. I am really, really grateful to each one of you for making it a hit on my channel and if you haven't watched this still i will leave the link in the description box below you can check it out so uh, you requested that you want the same video with mud and i'm coming up with that on your request see this one it's awesome my guys yeah i have used here some warm colors and i have used the mud thing अब वो एक्चुअल एक्चुअल वाला मड नहीं है जो पुराने जमाने में यूज होता था बट आई हैव यूज वॉल पुट्टी सो आई विल शो यू स्टेप बाय स्टेप हाउ वी विल बी मेकिंग दिस ब्यूटीफुल बॉटल आर्ट एंड गाइस प्लीज डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल नाउ सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग फॉर द टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड Let's have a close up look at this lip and art guys. It's a traditional art form from Kutch Gujarat. People used to decorate their huts with cowdung, mud and mirror to make their huts look beautiful and nowadays we use it in modern ways. I have cleaned this bottle thoroughly. We will be decorating it and we will be using wall putty instead of cowdung. and we will be using favicol ama to mix it uh, i have taken 2 tablespoon of wall putty and 2 tablespoon of favicol ama and mixed it thoroughly but still i think that the consistency is not dropping consistency so i'll add a little bit of favicol so you can check guys uh, if the consistency is not proper you can add we call or wall putty depending on it but basically we need the free flow now i have taken a poly bag and cut it in the triangle shape and i will be making it conical shape it's very easy to create a cone guys it's not at all difficult and just put a cello tape to secure now just pour this wall putty paste inside the cone and be careful that it goes inside and not on the outer layers in the innermost layer it should fall so just fill up the cone fully and then just press all the contents inside and then with the help of a thread we will be securing it from back side you can also use a cello tape but i found that cello tape sometimes deceive me so i prefer using a thread which is like more secure way of working with a cone so guys did you notice how easy it was to create a cone it was not at all difficult right Now we will be making this lines with the help of cone apply the same amount of pressure to get a proper shape of lines and if even if it doesn't come proper at the first attempt it's fine keep practicing eventually you will get through it even my lines are not so proper uh, it needs a lots of practice and patience but uh for a lot of time i have not practiced it patience to have mere paas par practice nahi kiya hai so even i am missing out some places on the accuracy part but it's okay i just want to enjoy the process of creation rather than aiming for perfection so here i am covering all the sides of the bottle now on the other side we will be making the same lines to get a criss cross of this lines and create a pattern so like this we have to fill 
it with this lines and let it dry once it dries i have applied one coat of acrylic white acrylic color with the help of a brush and fill up all the gaps guys uh, which nothing should be visible you can even use a sponge dauber to fill this white color but i found it easy to fill the gaps with the help of a brush let it dry thoroughly once it dries we are going to make use of this four colors first let's start with this i'll be using dauber rather than brush you have the option of using a brush also so like this we have to do dab dab and fill up all the places there should not be white color visible from behind so uh, be a little cautious to fill this and i have fast forwarded here guys because it takes a little bit time to fill all the gaps and we will be covering the full side with yellow color and these are the acrylic colors i have used you can use any brand there is no such restriction as which brand to go for acrylic colors only is the thing that we need so like this i have filled all the sides with this yellow color now i have taken this green color and applying with the same dauber i have not washed it so we can get a little bit of lighter green initially and later the original green that is the dark green it takes a little bit of time and patience so gently do it and now again i have taken yellow color in the dauber and just mixing to give it a shading effect to thoda sa green ke upar yellow and yellow ke upar green we will be applying now wash the dauber thoroughly and then use it so uh this is a dark color and with this if we use the green dauber it won't work so i washed it thoroughly and see how bright and vibrant it looking guys now i have used red color and here also same thing now i have not washed it and i am using the same dauber so that we get a combination of orange and red initially and then the dark red at the bottom now i am use going to you make use of this mirrors after drying thoroughly let's apply fabicol and put the mirrors one by one and just enjoy hey guys sabse important hai ki we enjoy this art rather than aiming for perfection because the vibrant colors eventually make it look beautiful and stunning and this mirrors have added to the beauty of this bottle can you see the shine the attractiveness of this bottle it has turned out so beautiful okay guys i missed on that part uh, above i have put some mirrors and then applied that borders with the help of cone so guys hope you enjoyed this step by step tutorial of lip mat and if you are recreating it please don't forget to tag me on your stories i'll be happy to reshare it on instagram and don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel now please guys thank you guys for staying till then adieu all bye bye